diesel fuel here, and I think we're going to meet Mr. Cutworm very shortly. You just can't hide money. You go to Starbucks, I go to the come and go. <laughs> I think I see a Mr. Worm. Does that help? Yeah. I'd recognize that Dodge anywhere. <laughs> You recognize the vehicle. I was looking at the person. Where'd he go? Oh, <gasps> there he is. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> How are ya? I'm all right. Good. We'll follow you. Okay. We unloaded it. She's gonna show Mr. Worm how to drive. Be careful! Don't hurt him. Giving him kind of a boring ride, ain't I she? Gosh, that's a tiny little thing. <laughs> I think it looks like a monkey in a circus and that thing. They use a bunch of these in circuses and, and uh, oh, uh, stunt shows. They use a bunch of them. Joey Chitwood and all them guys use them for stunts and stuff. You know who Joey Chitwood is? I've heard of him. What does he do? I don't know. Go ahead and tell me. Singer? Songwriter? No, I don't think so. Political activist? Yeah, maybe a political activist. What is it? Tell me. Do tell. That's my neighbor. Oh, hey. He jumped cars and whatnot. Now, does this thing have a trailer hitch on the back? It can. Because I was thinking if that Ford breaks down, we might <laughs> could load the Ford on the trailer and tow it with this. Right here's where you put the ball. Huh. 29 and a half horsepower, huh? Oh, 26. 26? So I've got a few things added to this engine. So it may be closer to 20. Now it's, this is a cool turn. Yep. It just purrs like a kit. Oh yeah. Or you can pull it like this and get both of them at the same time. Oh, cool. This is as far down as they're supposed to go, but you can lengthen this stuff Good out. Good modify. And do that. You gonna drive it around? I drive it around. That's cool. The brakes are kind of easy, but it's okay. We have to fix the brakes. Well, I went through the brakes, but they're still a little bit itchy. Crosley don't have good brakes. They had cable brakes, which is like no brakes, and then they had some kind of drum brake with little tiny things to make them work. And these has got disc brakes on all four wheels. The first American car with disc brakes on all four wheels. And they're modified after an airplane. So... <laughs> He's such a weird <laughs> She won't hurt nothing for the biscuit. Uh, it's 
have three speed up and reverse, back is first, then over, second, and then back is third. No synchronizers. It's actually a... No synchronizers? No. Cool. She won't be able to drive it. You can either double clutch it or grind it. She drove it. a dump truck one time. No, I didn't tell her nothing about it. It was unsynchronized and she just took off and drove it. See? Well, it makes us, makes me feel, you know, blah. <laughs> These girls just automatically get this stuff. Yeah. Let's open that right up. Yeah. Well, properly. Sweet. And there's the little engine. And there's my forearm. And I'm just a little guy. You're tiny. Yeah. <laughs> this thing's awesome. It's got a fat, it's got a fat header, adds a little bit more, and it's got a little bit of tingling in the, in the, the cam's a little bit hotter, uh -huh. and some other little stuff. Anything I could buy, I put on this car. Uh -huh. To make it run good, and in that video, I'm doing 70 really with no brakes at all. And I got back and I had two bolts on each wheel, I didn't have all four wheels busted on. <laughs> i tell you what, I did today, just today. Well, she says I've got it. We pulled up there at the come and go, <laughs> I pulled up at the pump. And uh, I said, I need to go inside and see if they have some fuel treatment because that truck's running a little funny. So I went inside, she started blowing the horn. I looked around, the truck's following me. <laughs> oh no! And she's. <laughs> I had left it in drive, I guess. <laughs> you were in it? Yeah. But I had all this stuff. I had the center um, seat down. I had all of our stuff from traveling in the middle, and I couldn't get right over. I tried to put it up, but it went in reverse. I put it back in drive, and I blew the horn. <laughs> Taking the first spin in the Crosley. I think he's having fun. It looks like a gorilla in a chicken suit. <laughs> I told him he'd look like a monkey in a circus in that thing. I think y'all can need to go ride with it. That'd be cool. Thank you, birdie. And away he goes again. So what you think? I like it. He'll save everything. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He does too. Whoa! You getting in my view there, uh, Mister Heavy? It's hot out here. I think that Mister Heavy Chevy could stay and play all day. Oh, don't that sound sweet? Yeah, I think you can do better than
Yeah. I'm going to slide sideways. I can't get my hand past my knee. said memory card area error Did you mess with it I turned it on and I filmed and I turned it off mm -hmm. that's probably enough <laughs> this little thing is <laughs> awesome what are you trying to say Mr. Abby Chevy back off <laughs> I've got baseball bats but I gotta give you one of each that way it'd be a fair fight I'm quicker than you I'll give her the short one then <laughs> this thing is awesome Run, it's good. Can you imagine a six cylinder? They made six cylinder, didn't ones. they? Yeah, the only problem I have with it is my knee gets up there and I can't get my hand around the steering wheel and pass my knee. These seats will scoot back. I told you that after. This thing is cool, it sounds cool too. Real cool. So you want to ride, mister? Yeah, and I've been waiting on you for quite a while. I think y'all should get in there. See if y'all fit. Come on. Get in. See if y'all fit. Yeah. Y'all deserve to get sweaty and... I gotta get up. Since yeah, your just get in there. Oh, well, that's how that works. Oh, oh, well, how many heavy Chevys can you fit in a 49 Crosley? <laughs> Enough. Front, and we're minus, minus one. I believe she could fit in there. <laughs> she could do it. There's Wait. still a way back for the dog. <clears throat> Here you go. Out of the trunk. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Push button. <laughs> this is something. Okay, well, say a prayer. <laughs> Over there, please. Here, John, Mister, you run that. You go out on back. No, you stay on the floor. Right. Right. You can see where I'm going. Spitfire will smoke it. We're gonna trust in the Lord and take Mr. Worm for a ride in the Ford. Woohoo! I haven't rode in the Ford in 20 years. And I used to bleed Ford. There's a KC 850. Might be fun to go play on that. Here she comes. I was starting to worry about her down there.
Oh, well, it can't be right every time. I guess, I don't know. Oh, I got a tire in the shop. Will that thing burn out? <laughs> no. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Let's okay. see. Catch it and dump the clutch. Uh, nah. Just don't hit the new house. I don't care what else you hit. Just go ahead. <laughs> uh oh, now you got to do it to redeem it. Rip it up. <laughs> you didn't even tickle it, young lady. <laughs> what do you think, pal? You want to race a VW with it? I'd get the VW. <laughs> what do you think, pal? Is it better than an MG? Um, yeah. It's got more letters. <laughs> and as usual, we drove the Ford, so that means we got to fix it. We got to replace this little tank. But luckily, in Mr. Worm's big town, there was a tank. Oh, we got everything for so, Ford. So we're going to change that right quick. All right. The tank's on. I think Mr. Cutworm's back there loading more stuff in the back of the truck, but I ain't sure. And we got to hook up to the trailer and load the little Crosley upon it. We thank you very much. What? We thank you very much. I love you, Marky. We had a ton of fun. Got to drive the Spitfire. We didn't drive the old Chevy truck. Later, we will. I'll drive it out to your house. All right. And the little man had a big time. I'll hold that for you while you climb down. Oh, I'm just going to sit right down there. I'm, thinking, I'm afraid that this, at least this part of We had a fun visit at Mr. Cutworm's place, right, we, folks? We yeah. Did. The boy Johnny's reading. <laughs> And uh, I'm soaked in sweat, so we're gonna go find ourselves a place to take a shower. Or at least me. It's about due anyway, because yeah. it's right here at the beginning of the month, and I don't think I've taken one yet. <laughs> okay. We had a great time. Mr. Really Cutworm's a good guy. This is